consumers are bringing devices to their systems and they're defining what security means to them. I think any um, installing or selling company that can take a, an approach of offering a do it with me option, do it for me option, or let it let me do it myself option kind of translates over to, you know, what they would like to have, the customer would like to have monitored as well. Customers want choice. Everyone's or every family's needs is actually different. So, um, so when we do our pricing, um, it's really to our mission. So our mission is basically trying to make the technology available to, accessible to everyone. The customer in an emergency wants a priority response in their emergency. We all have notification overload on our phones, whether it's you know push notifications or emails or texts. And the reality is that you may be in a circumstance where you're not even able to respond to your phone. And so uh, the idea that anything of value, anything that's important to you, that there is a 24 hour, seven day a week monitored facility that will handle and take care of it when you're not available um, is such an obvious choice, right? Yes, is there a role for DIY? Um, you know, DIY monitoring, sure, um, but I think that, that ultimately for the most things that you care the most about, that is where um, and, and where a professional professional monitoring can play a role. Like you said, we're all the builders we work for, we've never seen a time like it is now. They're all looking for you know added technology in their homes. Consumers are looking at technology through a different lens. Having gone through the pandemic, you know, of how it will save them energy, how it could potentially reduce their insurance premiums, how it will enable them to uh, have an easier life, how, how it will enable them to work and, and learn from home and feel safer and healthier. I'll just say that AI in this space is, uh, is relatively an, an infant, right? I mean, we're not doing a lot of AI today. Um, we need it, right? We need, the, we need the home to learn and understand how people use it. I think right now we see a lot of smart home devices, but let's remember a smart home does not mean it's a safe home.